I think the most special part about this house is how it always brings people together. And I think that for me is, is the hit. It doesn't matter how many things we have, how many plants we have, but it's always a really, really happy space where we can count on to always feel warm, feel safe, and to always have a reason to celebrate. I'm Devika Narayan. Welcome to my sun-filled, plant-filled, book-filled home. I live here with Koopi and my husband Joe. So my favorite thing about this house is that nothing matches. It's a riot of colors. It's just randomly picked things that I've collected for over a decade. Uh, there are things here which I've had since my first home. There are things we've collected on holidays. Uh, there are some of my things, some of my husband's things, and it's all sort of come together in this beautiful, happy space. One of the reasons we love this home when we were looking for a place was because it gets so much natural light. So I can grow all my little happy plants inside the house, including this happy plant of mine. This balcony is my little oasis. When I'm tired of Bombay, when I'm tired of the city, work, when I have to rejuvenate, this is the place I always come and chill in. It's my little urban jungle. I think I easily have about a hundred plants here. This balcony has been designed mimicking the house I grew up in. There's a day bed, which is my favorite part where I take afternoon naps. In the winter months, I actually sit here under my terranalia and I read a book, I chill. Koopi and I spend our evenings over here. There are plants that have been with me since my first house. Uh, there have been plants that I've collected from across the world and brought in here. These air plants are all from Thailand from my latest trip. The birds, in fact, that you see here are uh, from the Suraj Kund Mela, which I actually found on LBB. When I wake up in the morning, the first thing I do is grab a cup of coffee and come and stand right here. I feed my fish, I take in the day, think about the things that I have to do, and it's literally my moment of quiet, calm before I start my day. This here is my most prized possession. It's literally my zindagi bhar ki kamai, my books. Uh, I literally guard them and keep them senior se laga ke. I clean it myself, no one else is allowed to touch my bookshelves. I have books here that have been with me since my college days. They've seen, I think, four homes and two cities and about six different colors and coats of paint. This bookshelf is also home to some of my most favorite things, like these animals that my husband got for me the first holiday that he went when we started dating without me. I remember seeing this pink cow and thinking that it's so cool, who makes a pink cow? We got this back from Madagascar. I was so obsessed with this pink, hot pink, mithai pink cow. You will find animals throughout the house. It's like I'm making my own little jungle. I'm completely obsessed with bandars and bandarias. You'll find them in details on my plates, in fabrics, in cute corners. There are birds in all my lampshades. My most favorite piece in this house is my little Ganesh or my elephant painting. It's by a Gond artist called Ramesh Tekam. I found this on Baro online. I buy art that I love. I, you'll notice I have lots of colourful art in my house. I have a pair of Manjula Valdias that I love. I have a Lakshman Ali I love. And these are all Indian artists who are doing very interesting contemporary work. My entire house is built around this painting. It's always stood at the back of my dining table. My Ika chairs were matched to this dining table. And you'll notice I'm constantly looking at these blues and bits of these reds throughout the house. I love entertaining and I think my favorite days are when we have friends and family over. This dining table was a part of my earlier office and when 2020 happened I brought this home and it's been the epicenter of my home. Uh, we have loud parties here, we have debates, we have fights. Um, there is nothing reserved for special days. We use our best glasses, our best plates and we make ourselves a really good party on this dining table. I've always been obsessed with the idea of a daftar, a black and white space 
this is my office come studio work from home space whatever you want to call it basically sara kaam yahi pe hota hai my work is filled with color so this black and white room actually helps me think the best this is where i lounge and take my meetings and zoom calls from i have a desk in the corner which is also a fun oshiwara find where i work from these rugs are from delhi hart that i've collected over a period of time i feel so blessed that we've been able to make a home not just for our own selves but also for our friends and families everyone is so invested in our home they have a favorite glass they have a favorite corner my friends come and leave books here that they want to read in a specific corner in my house later our families collect things from their travels to bring back to our house and say this is going to be so perfect on your coffee table or on your bookshelf and i feel so so grateful that we have this place to enjoy celebrate and cherish our life with them If you love this home tour like and subscribe to LBB on Instagram and YouTube. Yeah. <laughs>